Hello guys, what's going on? It's me, a friend. So today we are going to talk about discontinued items. And did you know that the newest discontinued item in RuneScape 3 is Weapon Poison that was discontinued one and a half week ago? If you haven't played RuneScape for the past one year, since the evolution of combat, they changed the Weapon Poison. You can no longer use Weapon Poison to poison your weapon, but instead you can drink it and every single weapon that you equip will be poisoned for the next seven minutes. So every single Weapon Poison that people had in their banks and in their inventories was switched to the new one, but it was still obtainable. The old version was still obtainable from a few monsters like warped terror birds and one and a half week ago they removed those from the drop table and those who got to keep the old version of the weapon poison well you have a new discontinued item in your bank and also they made it untradeable so unfortunately you will not be able to sell it so most of the discontinued items were obtainable through the holiday events and I don't want to talk about those because they are really just self-explanatory you had to do certain event and then you would get a holiday item as a reward but there were a few items that were obtainable not through the holiday event and they later on became discontinued and one of those items is probably the rarest item in the whole runescape and I will explain you why in two minutes so if you look at the price of half jug wine, you can see it's quite expensive and previously jug of wine used to be drinkable in two doses. So if you drink one dose, it will say that you have half jug wine left. It's similar to a pizza, but later on they fixed this. They made it so you can drink full jug wine instead. And those who kept the half jug wine soon found out that it's actually a discontinued item now. And it's it just weird to think that it used to be like one GP item buyable from some kind of shop and then you could turn it into an item that's worth billions right now. There was a place in RuneScape called the Black Hole and anyone who would break game rules would be placed into that black hole without any kind of possibility to get out. So it's kind of like a prison and other people may visit you by purchasing a disc of returning which was obtainable for like 10 GP from a shop quite cheap I must say but then later on the black hole al along with the shop was removed from the game and the people who kept the disc of returnings they found out that the item was discontinued so the question still stays what is the rarest discontinued item in the whole runescape now this is something we cannot really know for sure. I, I don't think even Jagex may know this for sure because maybe they don't have proper statistics. But it has to be a warship. According to many sources it has to be the rarest item in the whole runescape and not that many people know that such item actually exists. I know I didn't for the first 6 years that I played runescape. The reason why I think it's the rarest discontinued item is because it was only obtainable in RuneScape Classic and it was a completely useless item, nobody needed it, it wasn't a quest item and I must say it was very very well hidden in a very remote location because it's still obtainable in RuneScape Classic by the way so you can go and pick it up if you really want to because I did in the video as you can see and it took me around 20 minutes to find it. So the people who picked up this item and kept it until the transition from RuneScape Classic to RuneScape 2 happened, which transferred your save file to RuneScape 2, including the warship, but it was never ever obtainable in RuneScape 2. So only the people who played the RuneScape Classic went to that remote location, picked up the useless item that nobody needed ever, got to keep the item, and it has to be the rarest discontinued item in the whole RuneScape. And talking about RuneScape Classic, did you know that Amulet of Accuracy is discontinued in there because no new people can join RuneScape Classic and there are limited amounts of Amulets of Accuracy as they are obtainable from the Imcatcher quest. And actually I have one, which is cool because I have a discontinued item, but they don't go for that high because people think that Jagex may reopen RuneScape Classic one day to the new people again, even though they said that they will never do that, but I think if there would be a high demand for that, they would just do it anyway. So hope you enjoyed this video, I uh, hope it was educational, and I will see you next time.